Hey you, yeah, you ever wondered about the true nature of some of the most fascinating creatures on Earth? Ever seen an ostrich? Big fluffy birds, right? They seem almost comical with their long necks and fluffy feathers. They look like something out of a Dr. Seuss book, all gangly legs and feathers. You might think they're just oversized harmless birds. You probably think they're harmless, maybe even a little goofy. Big mistake. Huge. These birds are not to be underestimated. These birds are like Mother Nature's practical joke. They're cute until they kick you in the face. And let me tell you, that kick is no joke. And trust me, you don't want to be on the receiving end of that. Their legs are powerful, capable of delivering a kick strong enough to fend off predators. We're talking about a force of nature packed into a feathery package. They can run at speeds up to 45 miles per hour, making them one of the fastest birds on land. So buckle up, buttercup, because we're about to dive deep into the world of ostriches. These creatures are more than just their feathers and goofy looks. Forget everything you thought you knew. Ostriches are complex, fascinating, and sometimes downright terrifying. We're talking about the real deal, the feathered foe you never expected. Stay tuned as we uncover the secrets of these incredible birds. Let's talk speed. These birds can hit 43 miles per hour. That's faster than your dog, your car in a school zone, maybe even your internet connection on a good day. And they don't just run, they sprint. Imagine a feathered freight train coming at you. That's an ostrich on a mission, and what kind of mission, you ask? Could be anything, really. They're moody creatures. Maybe you looked at them funny. Maybe they just felt like a jog. Whatever the reason, you better get out of the way, unless you're into getting chased by a giant angry bird. In which case, hey, more power to you. Ostriches are not just about speed. They are also the largest birds on the planet. With wingspans that can reach up to seven feet, they are truly a sight to behold. But don't let their size fool you. They can be surprisingly agile and quick to react. In the wild, they often interact with other animals, sometimes even forming unlikely alliances. And let's not forget their role as parents. Ostriches are known to fiercely protect their nests and young. A family of ostriches walking together is a heartwarming sight, but also a reminder of their protective nature. So the next time you see an ostrich, remember it's not just a bird, it's a marvel of nature, a speed demon with a temper, and a creature full of surprises. Respect the ostrich and it might just respect you back, or at the very least not chase you down. And that, my friends, is the fascinating world of the ostrich. We've covered speed, now let's talk about those legs. They're not just for running, my friend, those things are built like battering rams. One kick can kill a lion. A lion. You know that scene in Jurassic Park where the T-Rex steps on the car? Yeah, that's what we're dealing with here, except instead of teeth, it's a toe. A really, really powerful toe. So yeah, maybe reconsider getting too close. Unless you've got a spare set of ribs lying around. Or a death wish. Here's the thing about ostriches, they're weird. Like, really weird. Their brains are about the size of a walnut, which might explain a lot, actually. One minute they're minding their own business, pecking at the ground, the next, they're doing a mating dance that looks suspiciously like a seizure. And then they'll just stop, stare at you, and you can practically see the gears turning in their tiny brains. The point is, you never know what you're gonna get with an ostrich. They're the wild card of the animal kingdom, the loose cannon, the feathered embodiment of chaos. Section 5, Danger Zones, where ostriches rule the roost. So, where do these feathered fiends hang out? Well, mostly Africa, the savanna, the desert, that sort of thing. Places where you'd think twice about going even without the threat of giant killer birds. But hey, maybe you're adventurous. Maybe you like to live on the edge. Maybe you think you can outrun an ostrich. Spoiler alert, you can't. If that's the case, then by all means, book that safari trip. Just don't come crying to me when you're running for your life from a six-foot-tall bird with an attitude problem. Section 6. So, you want to befriend an ostrich? Don't. I know what you're thinking, but Dave, surely not all ostriches are bad. Maybe they just need a hug. Let me stop you right there. Ostriches are not huggers. They're not your friends. They're not going to help you move a couch. They are wild animals with powerful legs and a serious lack of chill. So, unless you're a professional ostrich whisperer, and let's be honest, those guys are probably just as crazy as the birds. I suggest you admire these creatures from a safe distance, like maybe from a different continent. Section 7. Respect the bird, coexisting with the feathered fury. Look, I'm not saying we should all be terrified of ostriches. Well, maybe a little terrified, but mostly, we just need to respect them. 
They're part of the circle of life, just like lions and tigers and bears. Oh my. They have their place in the ecosystem, even if that place is slightly terrifying. So next time you see an ostrich, don't run screaming in the other direction. Okay, maybe run a little. Just remember these simple rules. Keep your distance, admire from afar, and whatever you do, don't make eye contact. Section 8. Ostrich Encounters, a final word, and a chuckle. The world of ostriches is a strange and wonderful place. These magnificent birds with their towering height and powerful legs are truly a sight to behold. They're a reminder that nature is full of surprises, often catching us off guard when we least expect it. And that sometimes those surprises come in the form of a giant bird that can disembowel you with a single kick. Yes, you heard that right, a single kick. But hey, that's life, right? Full of unexpected twists and turns that keep us on our toes. And sometimes those twists and turns lead you straight into the path of a feathered fury. Imagine walking through the savanna, minding your own business and suddenly, there it is, an ostrich staring you down. With its menacing stance and unblinking eyes, it's enough to make anyone's heart race. But don't worry, there's always a way out. Just remember to pack your sense of humor and a really, really good pair of running shoes. Because when it comes to outrunning an ostrich, speed is your best friend. And hey, if you ever do find yourself face to face with an angry ostrich, try to stay calm. Panicking will only make things worse. Just remember what I always say, when in doubt, blame the intern. It won't save you, but it might just lighten the mood. When in doubt, blame the intern. It won't save you, but it'll make a great story later. Imagine telling your friends about the time you outran an ostrich because you blamed the intern for the encounter. Surviving such dangerous encounters makes for the best stories. Near misses with ostriches are tales of bravery and quick thinking. Assuming you survive to tell it, of course. And if you do, you'll have a story that will be told and retold, bringing laughter and amazement to all who hear it. So, here's to the unexpected, the thrilling, and the downright hilarious moments that make life so wonderfully unpredictable.